In this video, we'll see the review and performance of this single channel PWM generator. This model has a segmented uh, LCD display. It has four keys, two keys for frequency and two keys for duty cycle. These are the output. So this here two PWM pins are given, but both pins are shorted. So you will get the same output on both pins. Again, uh, you can see the serial interface given on this board. Here we can connect the power supply. So upper one is the positive and lower one is the ground. Again, this model has a display driver. So this is the display driver. This is the main controller, new uh, This is a 20 pin micro uh, 20 pin microcontroller IC. This model has power uh, regulator as well. So uh, this model has operating range around 3.3 volt to 30 volt. We'll get the frequency range. 1 Hertz to 150 kHz and the frequency accuracy is 2%. You see here I have connected the work connector. Now I will connect the power supply and we will see how it performs. So yeah, as you can see display doesn't look good from front side that is uh, very perpendicular to display. So let's check out the waveforms. What waveforms we are getting? So we will connect the probe here as you can see uh, so connect the probe and this is the single channel so we can connect either upper or lower PWM pin and the frequency is set to 5.97 kilohertz so let's see what frequency we are getting on the oscilloscope so yeah uh, I have set the frequency at 5.97 kilohertz I am getting the frequency as a 5.988 kilohertz ok we will set the frequency at 16 kilohertz now and we will see what what frequency it is generating frequency we are getting as a 15.87 kilohertz again this has little error and they have mentioned the error as a 2% so that is fine so thank you for watching video please like share comment and subscribe to the channel for more videos